My name is Danny Devlin. I'm a freshman in the Army, and I'm a team leader in Army Special Forces and an Army Ranger. Uh, suppose you're at home with your family, and you hear a window break a few rooms over. You're in the living room, you're on the couch, uh, first responders are a phone call and minutes away. What would you do? Where would you go? And would you make the right decision? My team in Survival Instincts has the answers to these questions. We're a select group of Special Forces and Navy SEALs that will come to your door, conduct a threat vulnerability assessment, and develop a customized emergency plan of action for you and your family. Currently, ADT and competitors like them will install alarm systems in your home, which are great if you're not around. In the event that you are, however, they do little more than that. Their services can be used in conjunction with ours, but on their own, they don't do a whole lot for you. In Fairfield County, Connecticut alone, there are about 70,000 families that make $150,000 or more a year. They have a disposable income to afford a service like this. A service runs from about $3,000 to $5,000, averaging around $4,000. And at that price, uh, there's a max market, market potential of $360,000 per year and or in our first year. Of that, we can profit about $130,000. I'm looking for a $10,000 investment for startup costs to secure an office space and uh, the equipment we need to conduct our initial assessments. And uh, within my current network, I have the QU School of Business professors uh, as mentorship and then other special operations personnel throughout the US military.